stuck with it and made the shoulder save. Felliver, one of the better face-off men for the Kings. That puck stays in the face-off six. Here's Felliver. Softly into the zone. Well, my dad uh, was a farm boy and grew up without uh, ever having the opportunity to play organized sports. So uh, right since I was little, he wanted to give me and my brother that opportunity. And uh, it's been great ever since. Yep, yep, yep. I want to play uh, collegiate hockey. Uh, currently, I'm committed to play uh, NCAA for Hamilton College next year. Yep. Junior A League. Um, it definitely takes uh, obviously a lot of hard work and commitment, but I guess the biggest thing would be understanding um, that you're playing for more than just yourself. Uh, at this level, there's a pretty big emphasis on winning, and um, it's people's day jobs to rely on you uh, producing results, so sometimes you have to sacrifice uh, uh, a bit of yourself for the better part of the team. I love playing the guitar. Yeah, I've been playing since I was uh, 11, and I mostly play uh, an acoustic guitar. But uh, yeah, it's just something that I, you know, play by myself. Uh, and actually, Glander plays too. So we had a jam session the other night. Yeah, we got him back on Sunday, and obviously that's a, a pretty big piece to add. Um, he was out the previous, uh, I guess, nine and a half games, I believe. Um, in those span that we lost him, we didn't win a game. Um, so obviously he comes back on Sunday. His presence gives the guys hope. Uh, it was big for our program. I mean, having a, I think the best defenseman in the league to come back into your, your team obviously adds a boost. So he's back. We've lost Barnaby uh, now to suspension. Before that was a head injury. Uh, Mason Vaughn is out with a head injury. Uh, Slima Hebroji with a, a broken leg. So it just it's uh, it's been tough with injuries. So that's why the young guys have been given an opportunity, and it was nice to see what they could do. I, I think Justin Felber has done a great job. I think he's fighting an injury right now, but you would never know it. Um, so I think that's important for the young guys to see that he's fighting through stuff. Uh, it goes to show you don't have to be 100% to play, and I know he's 20 and. He wants to, uh, you know, finish out his career and give us every opportunity to make the playoffs and, and not finish his last eight or nine games sitting in the stands. So uh, I've been really impressed. He's been able to fight through the injury that he's had and, and he had a really good game on Sunday. So I look forward to hopefully he can continue to do that.